Yo, what's up guys? Hope you're doing well. Having a freaking good day as always. So in this video, we're going to be making this absolutely awesome Muzaka. Muzaka. One of mum's favourite dishes. There she is in the background. Say hello, mother. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we're going to be cooking this right now. So enough waffling. Let's get cooking. So in the saucepan, we just got some tomatoes that we chopped up. But uh, feel free to use a tin of tomatoes if you wish as well. So we're just putting the, the tomatoes through the sieve now just to get rid of uh, some of the skin and uh, the seeds. Uh, by the way, it's uh, much easier using the tin. <laughs> so we're just taking some of the aubergine now and we're just going to fry it up. It gives such a better taste when you do this. Obviously, this is optional, but uh, it gets a few more healthy fats in there as well. Fry enough for the number of layers you want and leave aside until later. I'm just getting the garlic ready. You need lots of garlic. Got the onions ready for chopping. Okay, so we're just adding in the onions now to the pan. Just gonna fry them off. And now we're just adding in the garlic to the uh, onions. And here's the minced pork. We normally do this dish with beef, but uh, yeah, we've got some pork today, so we'll be using that. We've got this extra piece of uh, pork in here as well. This is like pork shoulder, and we're just blitzing it up in here. Obviously, you can just uh, use the mince like you would normally, but uh, yeah, we've got this sh uh, shoulder in here, so we're gonna add it to the other mince. And it's gonna be a bit more proteiny and uh, slightly less fatty, because we've got quite a lot of fat already for the, um, the aubergine, which was cooked. So we're just adding the minced pork into the onions and the garlic. Super protein-y, this is absolutely awesome for you. You really must get your protein in. So what are we doing now then, Mother? Well, the meat is now brown, so we're going to add our seasoning and parsley and oodles of oregano. Oh, okay, very posh. Give it a, a mix up again. We're going to add the tomato puree and then the tomatoes that we've prepared. Okay. So you need to leave it in an open pan so it reduces down because you want a fairly dry mix. Otherwise, it will just go to mush when you you cut it at the finished item. And a little tip: sometimes it's worth just putting a squirt of tomato ketchup in because it just adds that little bit of sweetness to it. Make sure it's keto ketchup as well, guys. Very important, guys, when you're cooking, is to give it the famous uh, taste test. Mm. Yeah, not bad, not bad. A little bit more salt, a little bit more salt, always good. Uh, yeah, make sure you reduce it all down so it's a, a nice firm mixture. And what have we done, Mother? Well, it's just the, the tray is greased and then it's lined with aubergines. Here it's about uh, two inches deep. It's better off using this in a loaf tin so you can uh, increase the layers uh, a lot more. This is only enough for like about, uh, uh, about two layers in this one. So I've got the first layer of aubergines in there now and we're just going to add in uh, the meat mixture. So just get a spatula and press that all firmly down. And now we're adding in our next layer of aubergines. Nice and thin, guys. Otherwise, um, they can be a bit tough at times. We're going to put our second layer on. Again, if you had a bigger layer dish, you'd obviously just repeat this procedure like a couple more times. And we're just adding our last aubergine now, and then we're just going to make our cheese sauce. We're adding in the whipping cream to the saucepan. Add in our seasonings. We're gonna add in some uh, nutmeg, black pepper, and now we're just gonna add in some of this a lovely grated cheese to add to the cream to make the cheese sauce. Oh, lovely, extra mature British cheddar. Sprinkle some in there. An extra tip to emphasize the cheesy flavor in a cheese sauce is to add in a nice dollar of uh, English mustard. And then we give that a mix around again with that. So we've got all the flavours in our sauce absolutely tasting amazingly and uh, just going to thicken it up now with a pinch of uh, xanthan gum. So you've got to be very careful with this, mix it quickly so you don't get any lumps and bumps in there. Or an alternative choice, you could use uh, some uh, cream of cheese and add that in and make it a really, really rich sauce. And uh, here's the consistency we're after, look at that. Just going to add in the, the sauce. Oh yeah guys, check out that, beautiful. Just spread the cheese sauce evenly around the, the top. To finish off, we're just going to sprinkle some of the cheddar cheese all over the top as well. Extra cheesy flavour, guys. Wonderful. So we're just going to add in the moussaka now to the oven at 180 for 14 minutes. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Check it out, guys. Here's the final dish. Looking absolutely awesome. Look at all that lovely cheesy and oh, oozy, creamy topping. Absolutely wonderful. We're just going to tuck into this now and cut it open and I'll show you what it looks like inside. Oh, yes. Look at that. Lovely, cheesy topping. Look at all those layers, guys. Wonderful, wonderful. Okay, check it out. Time for the taste this now. I think that's pretty yummy. Pretty yummy. If I say so myself.
Well, you did say so. so. <laughs> and there we go, there, guys. Simple as that. Absolutely wonderful keto moussaka. Absolutely delicious as hell. So cheesy and creamy and flavorful. Make sure you give it a go. Uh, let me know if you do in the comments. So uh, make sure you follow me on Instagram and follow me on Twitter. Stay tuned for more vlogs and recipes coming soon. And I'll see you on the next video. Take care and stay cool. Chicka bow 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 bow. Moo 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 zaka. So in the saucepan, we. Now, obviously, if you don't want to. Tomatoes that we've diced it, diced it up. <laughs> so here in the tomatoes, we've got some saucepans which we just chopped up. <laughs> well, now, now but you got to look at the, the, the well, screen. I'm going to put this in. I want to see what I'm doing. Don't worry. You look fine, mother. Um, you look beautiful. I'm sweating like a pig. Well, I always sweat like a pig as well, so it's no yeah. difference. Ow. What's that? The bloody lid. It's just a squirter. You need to look at the camera, oh, mother. You don't have to. Yes. <laughs> you want to reduce it all so it's nice and firm, like Mum said. <laughs> that sounds a bit rude. Too late. And to finish off, we're just going to sprinkle some. Probably want to take out the paper as well. So we've. Uh, so the sauce is. <laughs> what are you doing? I've got to be in it. You're right, mother. <laughs> the final. And there we go, dude. Send all of that below. And then we go to. Oh, fuck's sake. Watching the video. Okay. Mm -hmm. Slow down. Mm. And here.